Hey everybody, coming with one more quick video of today. Uh, this just dropped into um, my mind about Luke chapter 19. I think it's around verse 13 when God is giving the parable. Jesus is giving the parable um, about the 10 talents um, that were given to people. Uh, and he says in that scripture, uh, and I will read it to you. It says, occupy until I come. That is the main um, uh, message that Jesus is giving to them in that parable. Occupy until I come. And so that means that uh, whatever he has given you uh, in order for you to really get the message out about who he is, whether it be however God uses you, you know what he has given you, um, whether it be through you being a um, verbally witnessing to people or sharing with them on the you know job or whatever in the family, uh, praying for them, working in the kingdom of God, whatever it is that God has given you to do, occupy until he comes. That means don't just you know, we want to um, wait on his coming and be uh, thrilled and excited. And, you know, God gives us dreams and visions and um, different things just to, you know, be to confirm that he is coming along with his word that lets us know that he's returning. But you want to stay in a place of getting people to be where you are as you're waiting, as we're waiting for him. So that means, you know, yes, you want to wait. You want to be a watchman. You want to look around, you know, know what's going on, but stay occupied. Do things um, in the kingdom of God that will benefit others, be a blessing to others as we await, you know, his return. And so I just want to encourage you to uh, not, you know, yes, uh, we see a lot of videos on YouTube, confirmations of dreams we may have had, knowing that Christ is returning, but stay busy for him while you're waiting. Not, you know, so overwhelmed that you don't give him the time that he needs because he wants our time too. He wants our attention. He wants our talent. He wants our, you know, treasure what we have in him. And so, um, we just want to make sure, though, that we are getting the message out and not just, you know, because I've, I've been there just looking at the videos all day of, you know, people um, discussing Christ's return and confirmation to dreams and visions. But we want to get out there and whether it be praying for people, helping people. Uh, ministering with others at your church, maybe going to a prison ministry or helping the homeless, whatever God may have you to do, occupy until he comes. That means don't just let what he's giving you sit there. Um, share, spread the word about who he is, okay? Be blessed and I pray that you have a blessed week in Christ.